let's go back to our question and use the standard procedure to solve it. Let's check out the question first. From the question we know, we have three classes. And also, what's the color? And progenica. And we could re represent them, use the color in this diagram. So, three classes. The red one, Santosa. And then the green one, what's the color? And the blue one. Organica. And also we have two features. The first one, X1, is the petal length. Okay. And the second one is petal width. Okay. And then we also have um, all the weights initialized to 0.5. Okay, so that's what we have for now. From the, for the um, procedure, we the first step we need to draw out the network. Um, yeah, so draw out the network. Firstly, from the input layer, we have two features. Mm-hmm. Change the color. Yeah. So X1. Yes. And we have the second feature width. And we have a file. We set it can set it as one, so we have the input layer done and then we also have three classes which is the first one is our red oh sorry yeah why is this the red one let's call it z1 sentosa and then we have the second color Sorry, second class Z2 green, and then we have the third one, this is blue, blue, blue. So it's hey, three is blue. Uh, Virginica and features classes and then we need to connect them correctly so firstly from the first class Z1 the red one we use let's use red so to the first feature And the, it, the weight should be S1, S1, W11. So the second feature is 2. So, oh, hey, W, hey, come on. W21, yep. And then the, to the buyer. So is W zero one. So that's for the R the, the class R Z one. And for the Z two class also we have oh. so the weight should be here's one here's two so w hey come on w one two and then hey. here should be w two two here so w zero two and for the third 
class, we also have the build our network. So for this one, the weight should be has one, has three. So we have W one three, and here we have W two three, and here we have W zero three. Okay, so here is our network structure before the, um, the upper layer we have this structure. So right now we could start the step two to calculate each um, the z, z value for each class 